Yo, what's good, family ties? We're in ATL today. It is currently, what's today? Like the 10th or 11th? Today is the 12th. The 12th Friday of July. Not the 12th Friday, but the, it's probably like the second Friday of July. It's the 12th. We walking out the, me and JSB, we finna go get the car. Um, but yeah, this is a quick little walk and talk. You know what I'm saying? We just gonna chop it up about whatever. Me and JSB, you know? Yeah, Live cool. in the flesh. We outside and building, doing interviews, people asking them certain questions about their journey and things like that. We got the first guy, he was a, he was a tester. But, uh, Nate needs to charge his mic up so we can do some more interviews, but it's behind the scenes. Okay. We we still got we still got um some without the mic, but yeah, the mic is, is, is a like, huge plus, bro. Yeah. You think the mic like think the, the camera mic gonna be good? Oh yeah, yeah, it's still good, but the uh, the mic uh, the microphone quality is just like super od. Like you can't beat it. Yeah, facts, facts. Nah, but shit, we landed in ATL like what a Tuesday. Or no, it's not Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, pretty much. Quick recap for y'all. First of all, go watch the vlogs. I think there should be like two, three vlogs. Like a day one and day two or three, something like that. Or maybe I'll just compact it all into one big vlog. I'm not sure yet, but yeah, go check out those videos if you want to see what's going on. But recap, like just real quick conversation sake. Um, Got to the airport, took an Uber to the Turo, Turo to the BNB, yes. picked up Eli, picked up JSB, and then we went straight to a meeting. <laughs> straight. And it was beautiful seeing everybody. Oh, fact, bro. This, this that was, Andy, yeah, that was so Google. dope. Because that was your first time meeting all of them, huh? Yeah. That was badass. Hell yeah. I be forgetting that. That was so dope. Yeah, that's gangster. Yeah, many more to come. Many more. You, yeah, you still gotta pull up to the home, to the office in Rancho. Oh, yeah. Woo! To the penthouse. I might do that soon. The penthouse in, in Beverly Hills? Yeah, low key. I think I'm gonna let's plan that out for like next year or the end of the year. And uh, me, my boy Tony, maybe a few others, like the homies out there, maybe some business partners will all like pitch in on Airbnb. And then we'll plan it out so that when you fly out there, you have somewhere to stay too. And then we'll just make it a grind house for the weekend or whatever. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah, that's gonna be sick. Going, going home with newfound, I guess, inspiration, perspective, uh, yeah, perspective and things like that. Sheesh. I see a lot of people in spaces that I want to be in, so I'm like, it's possible. Mm. And around a lot of people, so. I heard them say, you're not here for no reason. Really believe that, so that make most of this opportunity. That's it. 100. 100. Yeah, just build a big business for, that was one of the my main takeaways today, or even yesterday too, when we were talking to the homeboy right here by the elevator. It was like, bro, stop looking for the sale. Like, yeah, like this, the sales are just gonna come, bro. But what you wanna do is you wanna cultivate strong, relationships and connections and, and use that to to build the first 10 the first four uh, of your solid uh, team right and from that team you'll be able to tap into different new markets and yep. really build a business from about that. working on yourself working on yourself those, uh, attract those we got part of Gary Cornerhead. Okay. Oh yeah, you know it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, you... my, that's my man. Okay, cool, <laughs> cool. Yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. all right, you guys, y'all say. But that's what we're talking about. Uh, working on yourself to be able to retain the good people. Because if you're not in the good space, if you come across good people, you're gonna be able to sustain the relationship anyway. Mm. So it's important to enhance all those aspects of yourself so you be able to retain good people and. About the team, the money gonna come after that. Mm. You know, I mean, the money gonna come after the money gonna follow, the money gonna run after that, right? So, as long as you cultivate a good team and everybody wanna make change as far as financially and mentally, because it's yes, it's finance, financial industry, but you work on every aspect for real, right? So, as long as you cultivate a group, a group of people 
Just forget the business, just forget Primerica. A group of people. Go meet people and build relationships. Yeah, yeah, right? Like, like, yeah, like, take the, take the, like, businessy, and that's what I thought was so dope about the conversation we were having yesterday at the elevator with bro, was, like, take the salesy, like, business aspect out of it, and just work on the realness of it, yeah. of, like, the actual cultivation yeah. of a, of a, a team and a network of people that are working together on something, yeah. and that something is the business, right? Yeah, so. that's what I said. When I was having a conversation with you, when you introduced me to the business, you, I didn't get so off the information about the business. Yeah, yeah. I, it was just the person you who, who you was, mm. the person in your portfolio, and things that you built up, and how you uh, constructed and molded yourself to be. That's what retained me. Mm. Because if you was just kept it business the whole time, this that this that this, I would probably like it, it, it just the person trying to recruit me. Yeah, like I don't give a fuck. Just the but. Just the person who you are, like you have a whole conversation, you have to talk about intellectual uh, type of shit, like shit like that. That's what right, around. right, and and that's like part of the realness of the business, right? Is like cultivating powerful relationships and culture, but also working from within. Damn, she was not about to stop. Huh? I stop. I, 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 <laughs> yeah, hit me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. Uh, that's a good car too. I need the money. Gee. My leg hurt. My back hurt. Can't raise y'all, all right? I'm all right, brother. Thank all you. Right. God bless. Ooh, downtown looking nuts. Look at this, y'all. Ooh. Ooh, we. Hello, baby. Talk to him. Yes, sir. I'm out here repping the high y'all peak. This is the team shirt, y'all, if y'all didn't know. I don't know if I sat down in the vlog yet, but... Back they're not like us. They're not like us. Not like Rocker Kendrick like that. Hey, bro, I'm telling you, everyone at the convention is like, hey, stop, let me get a picture with you. Hey, stop, let me take a picture. Hey, that shit's hard, respect. Oh, you part of the corner gates? Yeah, mad low. Yeah, I trip out on that all the time. Gary, like, got mad respect from a little Like, tons and tons of people. The network is vast, my brethren. Ooh, this is a whole nother event right here. This is crazy. Sheesh. Only the hot. <laughs> right. So hot, y'all. It's been like 90s. I'm, I'm roasting, brother. Only when we're walking around for real, though. Like in the convention, it's hella, it's hella AC. It's cool, yeah. Bro, I got this video of like a stampede of people trying to go up the elevator. That joint looked crazy. I'm like, what the fuck? Sheesh. Dog, I'm. Sketch. About what? Sketch. Sketch? Yeah. What you mean? Sketch, the, 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 the quote you getting that from. Like, he's like, what's up, brother? That's sketch. sketch. Is it really? The movie? Uh, yeah, yeah, you don't know what that. No, it's a, it's a, a streamer. I didn't even, I didn't even know that. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> I'd just be saying it because it's funny as hell. Uh, oh, we go. Oh, that's a cheat code right there. We just walk up the stairs and we right there. Sit Thank with goodness. Him. I'm gonna. Damn. <laughs> but. Oh, hell yeah. That's dope. That's dope. What the fuck? Oh, you know, Kitty Buddy Insides. Kitty Buddy Insides. Peanut butter guts. Woo! I need some of that. That's what I'm talking about. Smoothie gun. I swear I hit this button. Whoo! I like to shoot like 10 minute vlogs. Like just walk random. If I'm walking somewhere, if I need to go for a walk, like too much on my mind, I'll just go for a walk. And then I'll try and record it like this. Have, yeah. a, have a dope conversation and then I'll just drop the video. Like the 10 minutes or 15 minutes, whatever, however long we were talking for and the whole walk. I'll just drop yeah, I'll just drop that.
that way I always have content coming out like no matter what on top of the other like vlogs that were editing and a lot more and shit like that but I just call these walk and talks for real. Walk and talks. Yeah, walk and talks. This is the walk and talk series. Walk and Come on. Walk a taka. Walk a flaka. The youngest, bruh. There's an 18 year old. Guys, 18 years old with 300 licensed agents. I'm talking about, I'm talking about this in general as far as life, man. Right talking about things talking about. Like, I come what? from the same perspective we coming from. It really unique. Y'all gonna see us soon. Real. Y'all, if y'all don't already know about us, y'all gonna see us real soon. Worldwide. Worldwide. All over the screens, all over the billboards. Alright y'all, this is the end of the vlog. Not the vlog, but the walk and talk. Go check out the vlogs. Peace, love, and hunted. Appreciate y'all. JSB, we out! We out. I'm gonna throw some garbage real quick. <laughs> hey yo, this that Tony Hawk Pro Skater soundtrack type beat. Welcome to Ultra 85!